Hello friends, uh, this is Chalpesh here and welcome again to my channel Code with JV. This will be a part 3 video for the currently going on series like what's new in C Sharp 10. So in this video we are going to talk about the global usings in C Sharp 10. So agenda for this video is uh, like uh, we are going to see what are the using directives and then we are going to talk about the global using and how we can use this particular thing in C sharp 10 so let's uh, directly jump into the QG studio I have created a console app like this okay so what I am going to do here is I am going to create a model uh, folder so we have different namespace for that then I am going to create a new class and I am going to create a employee class so here you can see the employee class has been created so what I am going to do is I am going to create some properties related to that so I have created two properties there now here you can see I have created the console app one dot models now let's go into the program.cs now here if I want to use employee and here you can see like it's giving me that error and if I do the alternator it will give me this sweet list to use this namespace so here you can see like I need to write using uh, console app dot model so now let's create one more classes there we are we are going to uh, create one more class and here I am going to say print employee so it will going to create uh, the print employee class here also if I need to write employee like I need to use employee class it is also giving me this using part here also you can see I need to write this model and everything right now I don't want to write uh, this using statement everywhere what I need to do is I need to define that as a global namespace right so now here you can see like I can easily use that and here also I can remove this so now you can see like it is uh, if I remove this then also I am able to access this globe uh, employee class because now it has been defined as uh, global so now the question arises is uh, where we should define this global namespaces so best practice is, is like where you have your main method like this is the C sharp uh, 10 console app so uh, the main and everything is there uh, under the top level statement so normally like uh, to the other programs like your asp.net application or uh, that all start with the program.cs so whatever you want to use this global using uh, console app then you need to uh, go there and define all these steps under your whatever class you have your startup like main method where uh, where you need to define all this global using or uh, there is another way uh, of uh, doing that like creating a class which you are not going to use anywhere but you are just going to define the all the global using in that particular class so I hope Hope you like this video and if you like this video then please do subscribe to my channel also don't forget to watch uh, the previous uh, two parts of C sharp 10 new feature series so please do watch that and it gives me motivation to create more videos like that so thank you for watching and hope to see you in the next video